ladies and gentlemen, how are you? Welcome to my channel, Adult Education Ingredients. After absence for a long time, and I'm back now with you and share with you with a lot of things that are going on in the world nowadays. See, uh, as our world has went into fully potential, which is we have everything, technology is already expanded into the full extension that we cannot expand anymore. And we have good, uh, good living, good standard of living, and everything is in the full potential. As everything we can see, we have, we have achieved um, a lot um, throughout our journey from our ancestor to us, and we have achieved a lot. But the humans, humans' uh, satisfaction is never, never um, accomplished. It means that we. If we want we have something we we will want more and we want more as a result what do you think what will uh, be the result the result is the idea and the word um, and the idea of greed is produced so as a human as human beings produces more greed towards each other more greed for grabbing all the things that they don't have and they're not satisfied in the at the moment of the whatever life circumstances they are in. As a, as a result of the greed, we cannot control ourselves. And I mean, as I apply to some people, and they uh, result as competition, a very high competition, country with countries, people with people, um, you know, um, state with states or suburbs with suburbs, everything, everywhere else we have competition because as a human being, that is our nature that we can cannot avoid competition. So competition, uh, as a result, it will produce war as a country with country, people with people. And as a result, even um, the close cousins or the close um, connected country, we have war. So that is the result of greed, that is the result of um, competition, that is a result of human nature that we cannot avoid. So how do we avoid um, greed and all this, all this natural disaster, uh, all, all this disaster in the world, like the war and everything occur? So uh, as we know that the negative energy, which, um, which I was talking uh, about before, the greed, you have competition, um, high expectation of uh, of yourself that you want to win, and if you don't win, you will fight, and that is a result of human conflict and uh, war in the world. So how can I avoid, avoid that? So so to say, we are better in living positively and simply simple as a human being because it will lead you to more energy a higher energy instead of uh, focus on negative energy with war, 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 worry, worry, worry and then as a result human cannot do anymore because of the um, destructive energy and as a result they use weapons they use nuclear weapons they use missiles and all these bring this uh, destruction and um, destroying the whole universe. So as we're living together in the whole universe, human being is very complicated. So as a result, we need a kind of energy that we can sustain in this world, in this universe. We need a kind of energy, which is a higher energy, which helps us to resolve problem. We don't need negative energy. We don't need destruction energy to destroy each other because of we want something okay the result of war is bringing furthermore negative energy for example grief for example um, no food for example you have no living and living in a, a poor situation you have to rebuild the city you have to rebuild everything and it costs money it costs uh, and um, the uh, level costs everything. This is all destruction. This is all as a result of human beings' greed. And the best way to solve this is if 
every individual can solve their own problem. Like if they have their own problem, they can solve it first, and then they can solve it through uh, uh, collectively, and then worldly, and then you know, as a result, of course it is hard, it is uh, easy to say than done. But just start from the beginning, we have to solve our problem. So individually, personally, how are we going to solve our problem? The best way that I can do is, you can sit still and go through your meditation, go through your mind, relax your mind. Because if you're not relaxing, you bring destruction. And when the words come out from your mouth, you bring destruction. And you, when you're related to other people, it might have other uh, the effect, negative effect on other people. And other people, depending on personality, well, we have different personality. Everybody's in the world. We have different personality. Some people very um, extrovert, some very introvert. Okay, go from there. So, as an introvert, it takes negatively into, into their heart. As a result, it will spread. You know, the negative energy will spread. It will spread from one person to the other person, to the uh, collective group, to the world, to the whole universe. As a result, it brings destruction. So at the moment, we have so much war in Ukraine, so much war with Russia, and so much war that hasn't happening. We need cooperation and we need positive energy. We need to think that how are we going to um, sus uh, help to sustain this universe, living happily, and how to solve problems. Not using destruction energy, not using negative energy, and not using all this um, destroying human being. This is stupid. For example, you who think another um, alien or another uh, human, uh, I mean, another species living in another planet, would they would they laugh at us? They will laugh. Oh, this world, this you, this world, this world called Earth is going to destroy itself. You know how are we going to survive like that? The people in the other planet is going to laugh at us. It said that the, the people in this earth is not unified. As a result, this planet is going to be to burst one day. So we need to take this as a cautious that how are we uh, helping our universe to sustain so that the other species in the planet will not laugh at us. Okay? This has to be done from the cooperation of the whole universe, country to country, um, or state to state, as you say, that we need cooperation. We are all human beings. We are all created by God. And we need to have a unify in order for the world to sustain. As we approaching the, the, the uh, era, the final era of this uh, universe, we need to help us ourselves uh, to follow what Bible say. Um, how are we going to live happily, heavenly, bring heaven to the earth? So, in order for this to happen, we need to have everybody's action. Action not to have war, action to forgiving each other, to have a good talk, to have at least an ethical kind of mind. And to think about human being, fellow human being, are now suffering at the moment. You are thinking about yourself that what if it is you? It happened to you. You lost your family, you lost your uh, beloved ones and all that. How do you feel? How do you feel? I was thinking, I'm so agitated when I'm sick. I'm talking about this, sorry about that. So I'm really feeling from bottom of my heart of the world situation at the moment and I really want to rescue it. I want everybody to cooperate and to think about how to help each other, not to how to destroy each other. For country like Ukraine and Russia, they are like brothers. How can they fight like that? I feel so sad for them. How can they feel like they have the same blood 
they have the same species, same blood like me. They should help each other. Now, it is not too late. Try to forgive each other and knowing that we are all from God. And God wants all us to be living healthily, happily, and cooperative with each other. Anything is in conflict, you can talk about it, or you can let go and let live. Okay? Now it's not too late. So many people die in the war. And it is a very destructive time. And it is really grieving for everybody, not just that country, but for all of the world. Feeling sad and feeling um, pity and feeling really sad for these countries in war. So we need to rescue them. We need to put the world in order so that we are living happily in the world and anything we are uh, pointing toward other people say bad thing about people and you have point you have to point toward yourself and think what have i done wrong what should i do to improve the relationship can i improve myself first and then i can point the finger to other people because no humans are perfect no humans are the 100% um, perfect because we are not God. So, in order, before we blame other people, we can point our finger first. Have a self, um, um, self examination, and say that what can I do to help other people, and what can I do so that you know other people will not um, do this towards me. So by doing that, the best suggestion is doing meditation, doing self-examination, go to a quiet place, like go into a forest, go into a, a, the nature, mountains and everything by yourself and think through, what have I done wrong? Have I done anything wrong? I, am I perfect? Am I uh, like God? Because no one is God. No one is as perfect as God. So you need to re-examine yourself before you point other pe uh, your finger to other people. And you know, when we blame other people, that cause destructive slowly. It, will, it might be slow, a year, two years, three years, four years, and as a result, it becomes war. Because blaming people is the worst thing on earth because it will, uh, it's a, it's a spark of fire, it will burn the forest down, just like what we have now. So we need to examine ourselves individually. Okay, this is another ingredient of adult education. So now I'm going to finish up with, um, if you like my channel, please subscribe. That will help my channel to grow and I bring more and will share you with you more. And if you like it, please uh, put a thumbs up. It will help it will help me as well thank you so much for all that so i bring you more and share with you more and it is i also appreciate for those people you put comment there if you have any comment or any uh objective good or bad about my um idea and my suggestion just put everything down on the comment you can we can discuss each other uh, with each other we can i can uh, sort of go through the with with the one day we will do live and we can share with each other. We can help each other in growing and living in, in a better world. Okay, thank you so much now for tuning in. Until next time and goodbye.